Osmond jumping center against Cobbins of Oklahoma State. Duke Edsel tossing the ball in the air, and the Cowboys win the dip. And OSU has not led since about the three-minute mark of the first half. Keep that in mind. Smart dribbling top of the key, pulls up, long jumper off the glass net. Rebounded by Oklahoma. Why well, is that? I don't think that's a shot you want. No. Especially now, you got, now you're putting pressure back on yourself again. Defensively. Smart on pleasure. Four and a half minutes left in overtime. Tied at 73. Hornbeak, right corner, open jumper. Missed. Rebound to Brian Nash of Oklahoma State. He was wide open. Somehow missed. Lost Forte on the screen. A solid screen. Nash. 18-footer right side, off back iron miss, rebounded by Fitzgerald of Oklahoma. And suddenly they've gotten away from attacking the rim like they did the last five minutes of regulation. These two teams are tired, John. You can see it. Ledger fumbles the ball. Ledger falls down. Loose ball scooped up by Cobbins of the Cowboys. Down the floor to Markel Brown, attacks the goal oh layout. Miss! Oh, Cobbins is out of that me. And Oklahoma gets the rebound. Sooner's counterattack. Tied at 73, 347 left in overtime. Boy, how was that not a foul? It's unbelievable. Brown went to the rim. Everybody. Now Germs dribbling top of the key, goes behind the back. They switch. Foul line left side to Fitzgerald. Spins on Brown out to Germs 14 to shoot. Neither team has scored here in overtime. Germs takes and bakes. Backs away. Foul line on the dribble. Bounce pass to Osby. Right low post. He's isolated. Turnaround jumper over Nash is good. That's too easy. Ryan's got to got to challenge him a little bit more. 75-73 Oklahoma. 3.15 left in overtime. That was the first bucket of the extra session. Markel Brown left wing outside the arc. Throws it out to Cobbins, top of the key. Cobbins dribbling it. Hands it off to Smart, 17 to shoot. Right wing Forte. Pump fakes, drives. Left wing to Smart, 12 to shoot. Smart gets the screen to his right from Cobbins. Cobbins peels off, 8 to shoot. Now Smart guarded by Groom, dribbling. Left side, Brown, turnaround jumper, missed short off the rim, rebound untouched out of bounds to Oklahoma. ID. 75-73, Oklahoma with 2.49 left in overtime. I think you're right about being tired, this, but this is where the Cowboys have to get to the rim. They got away from it. They got to get to the rim here. And they got to get a stop here first before they go. Brooms hands it off to Fletcher. Fletcher dribbling on the right side outside the arc. Now drives it back to his right 18 footer. Missed off the back of the rim. Rebound, half loose. Goes around and Forte comes up with it for Oklahoma State. Forte dribbling into the front court. One of the foul didn't get it. Right wing Markel Brown. Throws it underneath to LeBron. Yes! Oklahoma by two, minute 49 left at overtime. Markel Brown, top of the key, defended by Pledger. Left wing to Smart, drives it to his right. Cut off nice, top of the key to Forte. Defended by Pledger, 16 to shoot. Bounce pass to Nash, left low post. Backing in on Osby, ducks under him, lay out the guy. Let's pause 10 seconds for station ID. You're listening to Oklahoma State basketball. Six, five, four, three, two, one. We're done. Dave Hunziker, John Holcomb, Mara Hunziker at Gallagher Ivo Arena at Stillwater, which is packed to the roof. Tied at 77. Oklahoma State in Oklahoma. Minute 36 left in overtime, and the Brian Nash. At the foul line for Oklahoma State to try to get the Cowboys their first lead since the first half. Well, this is so important psychologically, Dave. It's so important to get this one to go down. Here it is. Makes it. 78-77, Oklahoma State on top. Minute 49. Turn Kibbles into the front court. Top of the key to Austin. Right wing Hornby. Bounce pass underneath the fifth throw. Turn around jumper. No. Foul on the Cowboys. And Markel Brown just picked Cowboys up his own. The Cowboys running to Markel Brown. That's his fourth. And Andrew Fitzgerald.
Fitzgerald, who's a 71% foul shooter in conference play, 56% overall, shooting two with his team down by one. the first, tied at 78. Uh, back in for Brian Williams. On the offensive end, give you a little more of a threat. If you miss three throw, you cannot allow. Oh, 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 Oklahoma regains the lead by one, 79-78. Minute 19 left in overtime. Don't settle for the quick jump where Cowboys will call a timeout. Oklahoma State. Fans support the Cowboys and grab the hottest officially licensed gear from JumboKState.com. Use of over 1,500 Cowboy items shipped to you for one most flat rate. Look like a true fan by heading to JumboKState.com. If you're how knows in this situation, Dave, you cannot just set, set it for the jump. Keep saying that, but they can say it long after the jump. What they did the last possession, very intelligent. Marcus Smart waiting for things. He made Oklahoma work a little bit. He finally got a matchup with the Brian Nash in the low block. How many times he said this this year? When the Nash has played more like a four, and he's gotten the big one, he made great things happen. And Nash with 24 points. They don't have to come on the three-pointers. They come from work in the lane and at the three-point line. He's got 10 three-pointers so far. And now you've got uh, well, Ozzie with four fouls because that's what happened the last time he got it. Cameron Clark is stepping in from the line. So he'll be an active bigger body down low. But if you're the Cowboys, the ball security, the ball movement, and then isolating when you can get to the rim, or get a shot in the low post. So critical in this possession. And then, look, let's look face it. Based on the defense, the Cowboys have played today, they, they shouldn't be in this position. Oh, I agree. Oklahoma shot 48% of the field. And after a 5 to 20 shooting start, the Sooners have made 24 of their last 38 shots. That's better than 60%. Forte against the zone. Forte with one dribble across the floor to Smart. Fires it underneath to Nash. Nash! 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 has been a real just what you would expect a rivalry game to be. LeBron Nash with 26 points. 80 to 79 Oklahoma State by one. Nash trying to give the Cowboys a two-point lead. Spins the ball, shoots it, and it wins out. Rebound, fought for. Oklahoma falls down with it. Austin has it. A tie ball. The possession arrow will favor Oklahoma. With 49.6 seconds left, the shot clock is at 35 on the possession for Oklahoma. Boy, 
Marcus Smart just would not let go with that one arm. Yeah. That, that's some strength because Ozzy is a hawk. He just got 80 to 7. 80 to 79. Oklahoma State by one. And a steal! A big kill! Oh, kill down scores it! Down the third of Coppin! Spins to the goal! Lay up! Goal. by four. Smart second. Good. 84-79 Oklahoma State. Turns quickly into the front court on the dribble. Drives it all the way to the goal. Left wing. Three-pointer. Rainbow by Hornbeek. Misses badly. Rebound to Smart. Seven seconds left. Cowboys up five. Can run out the clock. Smart weaving through traffic. Hands it off right wing to Brown. One second left. The game is over. And the Cowboys in a double four. 84 to
sometimes a whole lot of stats don't make any difference because that guy just goes and makes play after play after play. And if Marcus Smart is not the best player in college basketball, he's the best player in college basketball. It is just, there's not even any. Anybody that watches the game and knows anything at all, the way he impacts the game, especially in critical situations, is unlike anything I've ever witnessed before. Dave, he's amazing. He's absolutely amazing the way he impacts the game so many ways. Loose ball rebound on either end. The crowd is full, I think it's going to address the crowd here. Larry Reese has the mic, the PA announcer for the Cowboys. Dave, you're exactly right. I want you to look at one other thing. Ryan Nagy had 23 points in the second half in overtime. Yeah. In overtime, the Cowboys win it, 84-79 over Oklahoma.